This episode, as you are aware, is about XRP. I wasn't aware of it. The price was only 62 cents, which was quite close. I prefer green to red, and I'd like to see 66 cents. If you missed the first video of the day, you should give it a try. We have two targets here, so pay attention. Stay tuned for this episode, people, before the big, freaking breakout happens. However, we'll talk about Bitcoin and its flows. Ethereum flipping XRP Brad Garling made significant comments about Ripple Bank and the team they're working with to launch this API service on Solana. After that, we received a whale alert, so without further ado, relax and let's dive in. Over the last 24 hours, Bitcoin 64 and 65 have gained 1.47%. Ethereum with a 1% increase, it comes in at 3,445. The USDC also finished at 99 cents. Not even the bull run's peak has the market up 12.85% at 615 cents. However, it's important to note that the total market capitalization of cryptocurrencies stands at $2 trillion, or $389 billion, for those who may not have noticed. I believe you should check the XRP figure right now. The USB was flipped in six spots, and if you missed it, I'm aware of two of them. That will disappear, hence there will you will want this since there are only roughly six remaining, and you will receive 100,000 LDN tokens with it. We will use this token for the Metaverse Marketplace and all our upcoming web games. We plan to list it on an exchange later this year, allowing you to participate in the market ahead of the major players. You should focus on it, as doing so earns you NFTs. For this item, you should try to acquire all coin. At the end of the first video, I promise to address the topic first. For Canano, we are developing an XRP rally-like event. I am confident that you understand the meaning of this term. I've already covered this topic, so I don't need to read the entire post. I have already discussed this topic, and so has this article. Observe this is really easy. Alright, Ada, at all times. The all-time high is $3 XRP, which we'll refer to as $3. It's currently at $2.80 off 8 and hasn't really changed yet, is it? There were only 30 odd cents. It had been 44 days or almost 2 weeks. This is still a fantastic time to purchase Cardano. I used to despise Cardano, but I've since grown over it. I'm buying Cardano just because I saw a dollar sign. That is how simple it is. I'm going to publish the post. Despite my plans for today and tomorrow, Corden people, I'm dedicating this time to you. Even if ADA reaches its peak again, it's currently in a state of dormancy, and I'm confident that this period will be extremely dull. In contrast to 2020 and 2021, when 95% of the cryptos we are looking at failed to reach their all-time highs, 2017 saw all of these cryptos reach new all-time highs. Let's call it 50 cents for the sake of easy math. We have a 6x slash 5x ratio here, which is ideal for cryptocurrency, in my opinion. Since we follow the sure bets, it's not worth it if you want to hit a 20 to 50 100x, you have to invest in some D. Here's why, you acquire it through Gen, however, rather than investing 5, 10, 15, or 20,000 of these D individuals, you are investing $100. Do you invest $100 in a single investment, or do you allocate $100 to multiple investments? How many hundred bucks would you get if you hit 100x? What did you enter before reaching the 100x mark? I'll stick with my safer bets and aim for a 5% return, but in all honesty, I'm probably going to wind up with a 10x return. That's simply me telling it like it is. For Bitcoin inflows, check out this location. ETF inflows are increasing, as expected. Given how early we are, we should have seen the second, third, fourth, and sixth waves of ETFs emerge from these institutions. What amazes us, though, is that we already know the institutions are embracing Ethernet and Bitcoin, it's just a matter of when. Previously, the question was whether the vast majority of institutions would adopt these assets. It used to be that these assets were on the verge of adoption. The question is, are the institutions coming now? 
When will they arrive? We know they're coming, and you are ahead of the institutions. How many times will you be alive? Can you conclude that there's probably just one? XRP is experiencing a euphoric surge, which could potentially transform Ethereum. Now that Ethereum's market valuation is 407 XRP 34, is it possible for us to reverse this trend? Yes, without a doubt. I don't see why we couldn't, and I wouldn't be shocked if XRP reversed Bitcoin at a time when the cryptocurrency is about to decline after reaching its parabolic blow-off peak and running out of steam, and money is beginning to rotate in XRP. XRP is typically our last mover when it comes to all cryptocurrencies, so I wouldn't be shocked if it reached $20. However, XRP must reach $20, as one would expect Bitcoin to correct to these levels. Perhaps we should aim for a slightly lower market capitalization. We need to reach approximately $1 trillion. I see it occurring, but there are still many questions. Will the ruling class allow it to happen? This two-minute clip featuring Barack Olinghouse from Fortune magazine is definitely worth listening to. As a young person who grew up in Kansas, I find it astounding that such technology has become a political football. Why would a Republican be in office? Contrary to the Democratic dynasty, innovation is something we ought to value. Cost-cutting technology increases efficiency, thus, I think it's a shame that this has become politicized. Elizabeth Warren is a prime example of this. Elizabeth Warren uses a common campaign talking point shared by all cryptocurrency advocates to criticize untrue factors such as negative accents. However, given the current tumultuous political landscape where Republicans support cryptocurrency and many Democrats oppose it, I am confident that I can provide a wealth of information. The first person I saw a tweet from was a reporter. This is JJR Jeff, I guess. John Roberts stated that Trump will receive tens of thousands of votes, but Biden will receive none since he opposes cryptocurrency. I'm not sure what he stated. Indeed, there is widespread support for cryptocurrency. I understand the tweet and agree with it, despite its lack of logic. Top Democrats, who I believe are attempting to resolve the issue, participated in a crypto roundtable in Washington, D.C., hosted by Representative Rowena Mark C.U. of California. About 25 people were there. Senators Mark Cuban of Utah and Jill Brand of New York were among the gathering, as was Anita Dunn, who works directly for Joe Biden in her role. It appears that prominent Democrats know I may have been wrong. I'll move on, I sat opposite another representative. The unnamed representative, who claimed to be there primarily to mop, added, this is incorrect, and I have already looked into it. The incorrect approach, I believe, stems from people's perception that certain individuals are promoting blatantly false things. As a result, they have to educate themselves on the true applications of cryptocurrency. How many excellent actors in this field are attempting to abide by the traffic laws, despite our repeated requests for clarification over the past five years? Please provide us with a clear understanding of the traffic laws. Yes, I hope this will become a nonpartisan issue, but for now, it's partisan, and I think Republicans, do you know Brad, will have an opinion. Given that SP is currently active, I find it fascinating that if Yukum wins in the November elections, considering his attitude and policies regarding cryptocurrency, we should it's that simple. We need to get Gensler out. U.S. crypto rules and regulations are necessary for these markets to fully explode and take off. I put this down. Where? It's significant news. Now, people, don't ignore this. The biggest bank in Southeast Asia offers seamless connectivity to ripple through the award-winning DBS API platform. DBS refers to it as real-time ABIs. Because it is Southeast Asia's largest bank, Ripple has simple access to foreign exchange. Don't forget that Solana, conversions from a single multi-currency account are helping Ripple expand its operations in Singapore. While we wait for a breakthrough, I will continue to provide updates. Solana has the potential to generate significant profits, with $300 just around the corner, I will continue to advocate for it. People, I should be purchasing more, 
but in my cryptocurrency book, I have a guideline that states that I must start purchasing assets at the dollar course and stop when the asset crosses my DCA. If I continue to purchase Solana, I will cease doing so. I am confident that I won't purchase Solana. XRP identical thing, Cardano I've got a room here. My space dots are approaching my chain link levels, I have ample ARB space. I still have a ton of purchases going down here, people, so I have plenty of space. You should review what you've decided to withhold and what hasn't yet moved. Don't delay, as time is running out.